This is Sean Conrad. I want to give you some encouragement for getting into voiceover work and being successful at it. I thought about when I used to work on the Verizon commercials that James Earl Jones used to do. And what was interesting about working on those commercials that most people don't know is he would do several commercials in one day. And these commercials would be for different areas, different types of commercials, uh, different lengths, and so forth. If you heard the tape, the recording of his voiceover takes, you would know, like I quickly found out, that he would not read through the full spot most of the time. He would actually do, he would start to record, say the first line, maybe get through the first line into the second line, but in that second line, he would stop somewhere in the middle and go back and say that second line again. And then sometimes after doing that three times, he'd go back to the first line and just start again. And it sounds like, or it sounded like, he couldn't read through the full script. Now, I'm not trying to, to throw James Earl Jones under the bus because what I'm gonna say that he was doing is perfecting each line, making sure each and every line was perfect. So all the way down the script, he would go back and start the line over again and say them differently with different inflection, with a, a different twist on the ending, a different smile or seriousness in the beginning. But he would do, I, I had to deal with sometimes 15 to 20 takes per line, per sentence of the script and pieced these Verizon commercials together, these radio commercials together. And they were for television too because we'd use his voice for what was happening on screen because he was the announcer, so it was fine. He wasn't actually on screen in a lot of these commercials that I was working on. But I really had to go through upwards of 50 takes, 70 takes, 100 takes. And mind you, this was for several commercials, but it was upwards of 70 to 100 takes to piece together all of these takes to make one commercial, one 15 second commercial, one uh, 30 second commercial, one 45 second commercial or 60 second commercial. So I'm letting you know that so you know that even at the highest level with great actors and people who have accomplished so much like James Earl Jones, that doing voiceovers is not this perfect one take science. It can be for people who read really well and for directors or producers who are not that picky, who are just like, hey, Sounds pretty good, let's move on to the next thing. I'm telling you from experience, working on the Verizon commercials with James Earl Jones when he had that account, that it was an exercise in putting together the perfect read from a symphony of takes. So if you don't read well or read perfectly, if you can't read through a script, don't be discouraged. Because if you have the voice, if you have that talent, if you work hard, you can still be successful at doing voiceover work. Don't forget to subscribe, click the like button, and don't forget to click the notification bell.